What's up guys, welcome back to the channel and today is volume one in the cool-ish dad's guide to the new age dad bod. That's a mouthful. So, I've been training at home in the current climate and it's got me to thinking, you don't need a lot of equipment to get a decent training session in. So starting with today's session, we're gonna start very basic, body weight only, um, beginner level sessions and then as we go through the weeks we'll progress to a little bit more intermediate type sessions uh, the sessions will be in depth there will be a full session each time so a variation of different exercises I'll give you reps I'll give you sets I'll give you rest periods you name it so anyone who's training from home or is just starting out on your training journey struggling a little bit not got the knowledge stay tuned watch this so volume one Two, the cool ish dads guide to the new age dad bod consists of lower body or legs. So before we get into it, I'll run you through the exercises we're gonna do. So we're going to do squats, we're going to do squat pulses, we're going to do a reverse lunge, alternate legs, we're going to do body weight bridge, and we're going to do calf raise. So we've got five exercises. Entirely up to you whether you want to work for reps or time period. Uh, personally, I'm going to be working for reps. I'm going to do 20 reps on each exercise. And we want to be aiming for three to five sets for a decent workout. So as I've said earlier on, all these workouts will be under 20 minutes. So they won't eat into a lot of your day. You don't need a lot of space, just body weight to start out. We're going to start out really, really basic. We'll still get that burn on. We'll still work the muscles, but we're going to start really, really basic. So just body weight open space, away you go. So as I said, fundamentals for each exercise, starting with round one, our squats. So when we're doing our squats, what we've got to remember is, keep our heels planted. We never wanna rock onto them toes, we want our weight to drive through our heels. That's our base point. Nice and strong through the heels. So we're gonna have shoulder width stats, we're gonna turn the toes out slightly, and as we drop the bum back into our squat, we're gonna track the knees out over the toes. Okay, chest stays up, core stays tight, knees out over toes. Don't let them knees track in, we wanna send the knees out over the toes, like so. So, we're sending the weight through the heels, we're tracking the knees out over the toes. Next thing we've gotta remember is keep the chest up, keep the core tight, and every time we get to the top, let's try and squeeze them glutes, activate the glutes. So, core nice and tight, deep breath, weight through those heels, Drop the bum back, track the knees out, drive, squeeze. Drive, squeeze. Round number two is gonna be our pulses. So we're gonna squat pulse, same again. Shoulder width, medium stance. We're dropping into our squat. We're staying in the bottom half as we pulse. Constant tension on the glutes, hamstrings, once again, sending that weight through the heels. Round number three is gonna be our reverse lunge. So. Nice strong stance, feet shoulder width apart. Okay, nice tight core for balance. From there, we're gonna drop one leg back, drive through that front heel and back to start. Chest stays up, back stays nice and flat. Round number four is gonna be bridge. So, onto our back. Once again, we're seeing a pattern emerging here. We're keeping the weight through the heels. So, back flat on the floor, hands by your sides. Drive the weight through your heels as you drive your hips up. Squeeze the glutes at the top. So, nice and relaxed, drive and squeeze. Nice and relaxed, drive and squeeze. Every time we hit that top, squeeze the bum. And then round number five is a calf raise. So, we can use a box or we can use the stairs, we can use steps to get a bit of a further extension. But for the purpose of what we're doing just now, I'm just gonna use the floor. Again, feet shoulder width apart. Just the fingertips on the wall, just the balance. From there, weight through the toes and the ball of the foot. Drive and relax. All the way up, every time. As soon as we hit down, we're straight back up. Okay, so we've got the fundamentals. Let's do it.
go guys dripping with sweat less than 20 minutes as promised don't need any equipment just your body weight a little bit of space that's all we need so the whole aim behind the cool ish dad's guide to the new age dad bod i'll get quicker with that, Is that i'll get quicker with that that's right but i'll get quicker with that the coolish dad's guide to the new age The Coolish Dad's Guide to the New Age Dad Bod. The Coolish Dad's Guide to the New Age Dad Bod. So the whole thought process behind this is, Dad Bod is a thing of the past. We don't need a lot of time to train. I'm gonna show you in these videos that you don't need a lot of equipment. You don't need any equipment to start out. I know you've got the kids, you've got the dog, you're working full time, you've got to take care of the missus or you get a load of headache. You can do it in the comfort of your own home. You just need a little bit of willpower. We'll get that shape, we'll get that tone. Down the line, we'll get some nutrition content in there as well so we've got the full package. If you've got any questions, hit me in the comments. Make sure you like and subscribe and watch this.